So if you read the Vancouver Sun on Friday, you might have seen an article about me and my business, which is pretty darn exciting. And if you saw that, you might think, wow, Jenny's so lucky, she's getting all this publicity. But I want to be really honest with you about what was happening for me during this. Now, it's really early in the morning right now. I don't have any makeup on. It's uh, just beautiful down here at English Bay. And when Jillian Shaw, the reporter, told me she was going to come out to my video workshop, I was over the moon excited. And then she told me the article might just come out in the digital edition, so just online. And I was like, oh, okay, a little bit disappointed that I you know, wasn't going to go out in the print edition as well. Um, but then she told me later, hey, it is going to go out in the print edition. So I was like, hey, that's awesome. And then when I opened up the business section, so this was uh, on Friday morning, I ran to the corner store to buy a whole bunch of newspapers. And I opened up the newspaper and I saw this woman entrepreneur on the cover of the business section. And I just thought, oh, how come I'm not on the cover of the business section? And then when I opened up the paper <laughs> and I saw my photo, all I could think was, oh my goodness, my teeth look so crooked in that photo. <laughs> so my big lesson I realized was comparison is a thief of happiness. This is a quote I read from Brene Brown's book. Sorry, there's a tractor over there just moving some logs from the beach. Um, it's called Gifts of Imperfection. And the quote again is, comparison is the thief of happiness. Because once I compared myself to this other entrepreneur who's on the cover of the paper, I was like, oh. And then if I compare my teeth to other people who have perfect straight white teeth, it's like, oh. However, when I just stopped and realized what I was doing, because, you know, a few days ago, I was just thrilled that a reporter was going to come out to my workshop and then it became, well, how come it's not in the print edition? How come I'm not on the cover of the, of the business section? I mean, it's ridiculous and it'll never be enough. So whenever you're recording your videos, really be careful that you don't compare yourself to anyone else because there will always be someone out there who does a better job than you in video or someone who is doing something cooler than you in video. But the reality of it is there's also probably way more people who are doing way less than you and aren't doing such a good job or as good job of, of, as you in terms of video. So compare yourself to yourself. You know, when I did that, it was like, right, this is the first time a major newspaper is writing an article about my business. That's pretty darn good. And I can feel good about that if I compare that to myself. So when you're doing your recordings with your video, just re compare yourself to yourself. You know, maybe a few months ago, how was my video presence and how is it today? You know, if it's something that you've been really working on. So just um, wanted to share that that was a big lesson for me and that I really had to walk my talk in terms of realizing my small insecurity about my crooked teeth was something that no one else really noticed. All right, uh, thanks so much for your time and make sure to go to JennyBeck.com for more video tips and please share this video as well. It's J-A-E-N-Y-B-A-I-K.com and remember, don't get left behind. You can shine online.